my entire life. You've protected me. It's the only thing I've ever known that was true. This is everything. Our last chance. You fought for this whole world. I'm supposed to kill God. Oh. <laughs> Boys. Sounds like a road trip to me. Supernatural. New episodes begin Thursday, October 8th, stream free next day on the CW app. So last night, we completed 326 episodes of Supernatural. And at the very end of every one of those scripts are three words, to be continued. Today, we start episode number 327. And at the very bottom of the very last page of this script, there are only two words. <sighs> Happy Friday, everybody. You can't do this to the fans. It's awful, horrible, hopeless. I can do anything. I'm a writer. Fans are gonna love it. myself I was like I either am just like cool now or like I'm dealing with this and then on a, on somebody's birthday I sat in the airport and I was like oh you know I had already texted him but I was like I'm gonna like give a little happy birthday post to, to my boy and uh, often I'll just find like a picture usually of us when we're what were we 13 when the show started <laughs> yeah. kind of post like it's been so long but I was like let me see if I have something Sometimes I have some little gems of uh, skiing or hanging out in my photo album. And so I found a photo. Those will all be released later this year. <laughs> <laughs> There's an app. It, uh, uh, little so gems. I, yeah, little gems. And so I found, a, uh, I found a photo from our last ever photo shoot as uh, Sam and Dean. And it was like, oh, cool, this is going to be awesome. And then I started typing it, and it was like a small violin was playing. <laughs> I counted on my fingers how many birthdays I had spent with this dude. 
And I was like, ah, shh, oh God. Like, now it's hitting. It's happening. And we said it. It's we happening. Like, yeah, but we were like, March. We'll feel it March. We'll feel it March. We're like, oh, whatever. Sure enough, March, and then like, uh, you know, that was March 1st, then March 2nd was the one month mark, then March 3rd was Mercedes Girl's birthday, rest in peace. Because like, everything was like, this is the last ever blah, 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 before, the, uh, this is the last, this is the last time we'll be on this <laughs> Corona, Corona. Uh, no touch, you read the policy. I love um, it. He's with the policy. It's true. Like it was. Uh, I mean, you you were having these kind of emotional feelings at the beginning of the season in yeah. July. Yes. <laughs> this, is, this is the this is the, the last yeah, first day. <laughs> and that's true. But you know, and and rightly so. Like it, it was. This whole season has been uh, you know it's been very emotional and very reflective. Uh, and I, I certainly was like, ah, I'll deal with it later. I'll deal with it later. And sure enough, I was telling him, it was like, March is gonna hit. It was like March 1, and here was the problem, why it hit. I ended up reading like the last few episodes. Wow. And... <laughs> Y'all made a four to That two. was... <laughs> so, uh, yeah, so we just got a, a, a the last, the final episode, we we had given we had been given kind of a verbal overview of how it was going to go. In what May or June after uh, yeah last summer, yeah. and uh, but we hadn't seen anything written. There hadn't been any outlines or any uh, breakdowns or certainly no scripts. And, um, something just kind of came through the through the wire on Friday, and I sat down in a trailer and I I decided to read it out loud to some people, and I didn't make it through like one page. <laughs> Oh, it's tragic. <laughs> feel anything, Sammy. I wish I couldn't feel a damn thing. Now, not to say that this, this, yeah, not to say that the story is tragic, but just like, it's like, is it me being, you know, emotionally, <laughs> an emotional wreck reading these things, uh, it was crazy, but it but it does it kind of it, like you said when you look through those photos, you start reflecting, you start looking back, and you're like, wow, this is I've I've never there's never been anything uh, consistent in my life longer than this show. Um, I've never done anything more consistently, um, and it's you know it's a it's a lot. I've, so it's going to be a big boy. That's two resident college dropouts. It's just like it should have been.
Dad's on a hunting trip. And he hasn't been home in a few days. Jess, excuse us. We have to go outside. Bye, boys. No, it's been, it's been, and frankly, and this is obviously on camera, so maybe I shouldn't say this. I feel like the show could go 15 more, honestly. Like, I feel like we have so much that we could do, so many stories we could tell. Jensen, what's going on with Supernatural right now? Essentially, we just pressed a giant pause button. Uh, we were one day into our second to last episode, oh. and it was, uh, it, it, we were so, so, so close. And I, I just keep chalking it up. I mean, we're 15 years in. It's just the show that will never end. Since since it was determined that the show was going to end at 327 episodes, um, I would like to think of this as a see you later, not as a goodbye. Um, so I, I don't know when that would be, but uh, yeah, uh, they have my phone number. So it wasn't really if I if I played Sam Winchester for my entire life, I I. I die happy you know um as long as he had a story to tell and he does have a story to tell um and he's telling that story and maybe uh on april 5th when jared and sam say goodbye to each other hopefully it's see you later and not goodbye you know we'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get to it uh. <laughs> um the show could go for the show could go for many more years and still be a, a great show leaving not only the, the, the fans wanting more, but also us wanting more. Like, I hope this isn't the last time I'll play Sam Winchester. Um, nothing, nothing ever stays dead in Supernatural. Yeah. yeah, this is also the last time we get to see you guys as uh, Sam and Dean Winchester. Oh. Yeah. For now, for now. For now. Fingers crossed. Yeah. We got work to do. That's Chuck's ending? No. No, I don't think so. After everything that he has put us through, I'll be damned if I'm gonna let some glorified fanboy get the last word. No doubt, endings are hard. But then again, nothing ever really ends, does it? I, it came to the point of like, okay, I think this is the right time. Like, I, it was a, it's a weird decision. And then I'm gonna sell them out. <laughs> when Jensen got to Vancouver two weeks ago, I have a text message from him. He's like, man, he's been back in Vancouver. I feel like we could do two more years. And I was like, let's talk, man. Like, I, <laughs> to all the lesbian family out there, so thank you so much for uh, taking this journey with us for 15 years. Uh, love you. And we won't be gone long, I promise. Thanks for watching Wayward Winchester. Subscribe for more awesome Wayward content. Till next time, as always, no chick flick moments. Peace.